It's a great day for gaming, everybody. Welcome back. We are playing Dark Souls 2. The I seventh have... game in the series. <laughs> the, the most important game of the series. And I have my brother here with me. My brother, Andrew. Andrew. Hello, I'm here. Uh, I'm from, coming from Texas, so I came a long way for this video. Just for this video. I'm being paid 50 an hour, so let's see if it's worth it. We didn't cover his traveling expenses, though. <laughs> All right, let's hop in. Now, my brother is quite good at this game. Um... Interesting enough, we uh, both started playing it at the, around the same time, but uh, Andrew plays it almost religiously. <laughs> Perhaps you've seen it. Some might say that, yeah. Maybe in a dream, a murky, I, I only I have about land. 450 hours on here. Only on uh, Dark Souls 2. But then there's Far the first in, and I have about 75 on there. So what about uh, Dark Souls 3? Dark Souls 3, I have about 200 so far. Dark Souls 1. Uh, about a hundred. Place <laughs> where souls may mend your ailing mind. And uh, Bloodborne, I have forty-five. So, Bloodborne, you have forty-five. Yeah. You will Not lose everything. Yeah, well, it's not a beat. Me. Uh, I have two characters in the world. The symbol of the curse. Well, you got halfway, then you stopped, and then you played it more, and then you stopped. An uh, of darkness. No, I, I like to when I play. I, I leave your my past, characters on. Your future. So a lot of the time is from that. But your very light. Oh, it's a trickle down experience. Right. Uh, Look how experienced I am by letting my character idle. <laughs> <laughs> None will have meaning, and you won't even care. So what By is the then, of this game, you'll be something story. other than human. Why is that spider on the wall? You know, you, a thing oh, that, that feeds is, on um, souls. A hollow. Uh, no, actually, that's game. probably just a random spider. A random spider? Yeah. Long you know you know ago, ago in a walled like off land Does it? far to the north, having, uh, milky eyes like that. <laughs> well, a great king oh, right. built a great <laughs> kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Why no? <laughs> yeah, familiar. Wrinkly. Well, super wrinkly. No, Why no? How no. could you be? <laughs> but one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without mean. really knowing why. You know, I, I told you I'd use a rapier. Yeah. But I think I'm going to use a mace. A mace? <laughs> yeah. <Okay. laughs> Maces we'll are cool. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. I'm not quite sure yet. The rapier is probably more effective, but that's okay. <laughs> why, why the change? Mm. Well, fun fact here. So when the game came out, the speedrun strat was to use a mace. Really? And then it quickly changed once people realized the rapier is much, much better when you put the, the uh, magic buff on it. So... Did you do this to fight uh, Rom, that giant spider? Yeah. Rom the Voracious, I think yeah, it's called. Yeah, he definitely did. <laughs> that guy was a douche. <laughs> <laughs> that guy was a real ass. Alright, we can finally start the game. Let me just wake up after being uh, drugged, I guess. Yeah, all those drugs just finally worn off. It's like, oh. 
Or maybe they're kicking in. Maybe took LSD and you're just like, look at my skin. It's like I took crocodile or something. <laughs> You just don't get up, you land ahead first. And you <laughs> That's the game! That's the game, thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's a pretty cool scene to see right away. Yeah. I think it's betwixt, so we're not gonna waste our time. When you're in a new game, uh, I think plus two. Maybe it's just the first new game, but there's gonna there's falconers that are here. So as soon as you start the game, they just fuck like, you? Yeah, there's <laughs> with crossbows that just, just destroy you. That's awesome. I mean, luckily you have your weapons still, but. They still do a lot of damage. Yeah, it's a cheap move. That's funny though. That's <laughs> just like already there. Right? Oh yeah, as soon as you start a new game, there's already mobs just waiting to get you. <laughs> <laughs> what seems to be the rocket? This is uh, the pleasure house. Yeah, oh, there's the one good girl. <laughs> She's the one. See the one over there on the right. She's the one who runs this place. Everybody else are workers. That's why it looks so bad. <laughs> Yeah, it's this is the cheapest undead. brothel in all of yeah. the, the land. <laughs> An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All That's what they advertise. Like, hey, come check out the brothel. It's all the oldest, the oldest women you can find. It's like when you go to like Hooters. Half the time when you're at Hooters, it's like the B team. It's just like old ladies <laughs> who are just like, okay, I have to cover the position, so I'm here. Finished. Yeah, I, uh, I usually the order the hungry. chicken breast. Hold yeah, the chicken. I hold the chicken. <laughs> I got a glass yes. of milk. <laughs> one of them. Uh, Hollows prey upon them. Them. Feast upon their soul. Okay, come on. Let me make my character. <laughs> this is the fate of the cursed. Your face is weird. <laughs> Back on, uh, one of the big differences between Dark Souls series and the, uh, Demon Souls what game, is your name? or the game Demon Souls, is that basically darkness was taking over the land. What are you gonna call yourself, Andrew? Yeah, I think you're good. <laughs> Big Pop, yeah, alright. That's uh, what they called me back in the day, so. Oh, what? What's going on here? Yeah, yeah, we're good now. Okay. We're good. We're good. <laughs> one of the big things on Demon Souls is that darkness takes over the land and steals your soul, basically, and you become the undead. And here, like, every game it changes a little bit, but I feel like the general Dark Souls thing is like, you have to go kill the bad souls. Yeah. Take a closer look. But, uh, your hands are green. Dude. Who do you think it's supposed to be? What the? Think back. Oh, that's uh, the human effigy. Past. Yeah. Interesting. Yes. It's, not real it's an effigy <laughs> of you. How, when you're doing your dodges, how does that break? How right. do you not break that? Like, I feel like if you just squeeze it a little bit, it would just pop. Um. So. Explore. Be a cleric and then go. All the way. The cleric, yeah, but I, uh, cleric and then great soul the whole game, or great sword the whole game. See, but then I have twelve faith. That's the only thing I don't like. And th right, wait, cleric and three then only endurance. Use your hands. That sounds horrible. <laughs> only use my hands. <laughs> Let's see. You don't you do? Aren't maybe, you gonna do explore? Maybe I will do this one. What is that? The swordsman is a is a dex build. Maybe I'll just do the rapier because it'll be it's cheaper to buy. And I start with swords, it'll, be, it'll just be easier. Alright. What's your gift gonna be? My gift will be... <laughs> a gift from the, uh, the workers at the brothel? You know what, let's just do healing wares, because the only thing else that's useful is this. Petrified something, you give it to, um... The crows. The crows, and they'll give you a reward. That's only useful for speedrunning, and the rest of it's garbage. <laughs> so... <laughs> you can just, you know what? He looks fine. Yeah, that's good. He looks good to me. This is your true self, Andrew. All people come here for the same reason. I am To break the curse. <laughs> You're no I different, I top. should think. There's mm. something crazy. <laughs> it's just like, straight up gasoline. <laughs> yeah, it's just like kerosene and like a cup. Just, just, that's, why just they're all fun. that's why they're blind. We <laughs> 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 figured it out. We figured it out. <laughs> 
is like the crappiest controller ever. Really. Get through the door. Wow. And trot along to the gate. Well, at least you it works. It works, though. Hold on this is your sex toy? This is my sex toy. Alright, uh, gun down. It's my shield. I don't know where the gun is. <laughs> oh, I'll wow, fool you no longer. You lose no, game yourselves. Are they? Yeah, it's... Over I think first, I saw that. I just I, I started the first episode because okay. I yeah I should I'm never gonna play it. I might as well watch it. The first episode's like an hour and a half, so I just stopped. <laughs> and there's like 97. Are you episodes serious? The just, first episode? Yeah, and there's Holy like 97 shit. episodes right here. It's like some absurd number. Wow. <clears throat> All right, well, now know. we gotta play the game. So I've been trying to like like me and my Danny, the guy I do this channel with. I'm trying to like uh. Like we're trying to do like multiple uh, multiple episodes in a day, record them and edit them and like upload them and all that. And it's so hard to do so many episodes in a day. Oh, it's very time consuming. Yeah, it's it's hard. Like, cause especially since I get off of work at like 6:30, gets here at like 7:30 to 8, and then we like try to get like seven episodes done in a day mm -hmm. to cover like. The whole week and then next week. It's just it's a lot of work. So I can only imagine how Game Grumps is, and they're like there's like a new episode every day. All different there's games. There's more than one. They usually do like two a day. Oh, like really? a bit, well, it, well, I think like, it really they have a depends. they have a team. Right. They they have paid editors and, and like yeah a, they have like, like two a, two everything. editors and so that, those people edit obviously and uh, render all that stuff. They have like dedicated computers. I don't have dedicated computers really for rendering. So, I'm just using like, regular computers to render. So, there's just like some. an easy 4 core and an easy 6 core, nothing like powerful. But, uh. so. it takes forever. I'm trying to get the new AMD stuff, the new CPU and motherboard. I'm actually uh, saving up quite a bit for that right now. They just released a whole bunch of, uh. The 4 core and 6 cores. When you start working, you should definitely look in getting one. The, uh. Six core is like 200 bucks. Wow. But uh, a bunch of people are doing like these. Uh, not, no, not even the six core, the four core. There's a four core with eight threads. So the threads help it like process more and faster. Right. And uh, what do you call it? some people have been making these like top of the line four core uh, Ryzen builds. Mm -hmm. And those four core are only like $150. Really? Plus the motherboard, since you only have one graphics card. A motherboard can cost you probably eighty-seven dollars, I think it is, and then some uh, RAM. That's not bad at all. You should definitely look into it. Andrew. I think I'm just gonna use a skimmy. Like I said, two-handing weapons in so this that game. Uh, is that isn't this where you can like? However, don't you get a? Uh, you can stance them. Yeah, you get stances on this one. Yeah, see, none of the other games have stances, but this one. Which I like stances. Really cool. I forgot what sword it was. There's like two. It was like a great sword. And you can, if you like dual wield them, it's like crazy stancing, and it's just like crazy power. I love it. I really enjoy how you can stance in this game. I think it's really cool. Um, it provides people that like to dual wield certain weapons a more viable build. Yeah. Unfortunately, in Dark Souls 3, that is not a thing. <laughs> but there's weapon arts in Dark Souls 3, so I guess it makes up. For it. And um, yeah, like the uh, the Abyss Watchers. That's the uh, great sword with the dagger, right? Yeah, that was, that was cool. I guess I could have started with the base build because it gives me a better base to start the game <laughs> off with because you had the pre-order. Ah. So if you pre-order Dark Souls 2, you get all those extra weapons right off the bat. They're not necessarily... S none of them are good but the base. <laughs> so it's not Is really it good. all crystal weapons or are they just regular weapons? Uh, they're not crystal weapons. Crystal weapons are Dark Souls 1s. Yeah. They're, they, were, they don't last as long. But they do much, much more damage. Yeah, I did. Uh, I used a crystal mace in Dark Souls One. I remember it broke so quick. Or no, the crystal halberd. Andrew, if you give me your armor, I'll. Uh, I'll... <laughs> What's <laughs> it? Black trim. Black trim looked the coolest. Black trim, but it's like yeah. it's like right above steel. So. Or, Right below Mithril, yeah. Yeah. That was so cool looking. It was, it was very cool looking. And it was expensive because it was the coolest looking. Yeah. 
That was, that was one of those armors you can get without paying for it. Yeah. Being a, a premium member. Oh yeah, I rocked that stuff all the yeah. time. But I sold it all the time just to make some money. Like, I was constantly merchanting. Oh, oh, oh god. Stop. You got an arrow on your side. Right in your lungs. Oh, uh, in your Wow. So what's your first order of business on here, Andrew? My first order of business is to run up to the... High Knights? The, uh, no, well, let's see if I can actually get this without dying. So the first thing, it's a little bit easier to do this, because if I lay down. Yeah. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and not kill these guys, because it's a waste of my time. Unless you die. Yeah. Run straight in and get comboed in the <laughs> Yeah, Andrew knows this this game like the back of his hands. It's insane. And... Oh no! I really don't like your Xbox controller. I'm just gonna say that. Why is that? Um, it feels like the buttons don't really press, but that's okay. That's the Xbox controller again. I just I have never been one to use Xbox controllers. Um, there's a uh, there's a PlayStation 4 wireless dongle you can get for like 20 bucks. You can use your PS4 controllers with it. Well, I usually just plug my PS4 controller into my computer, and it's just... It's yeah, but I don't like the cord. Yeah. I grew up with cords on my controllers, and I think I've done my time. <laughs> done with it. Well, let's see if the glitch works. So there is a glitch. You just come here and buy a firebomb. Okay. Buy a firebomb. We're going to equip it. And uh, get the shortcut without even leaving the bonfire. Nope, it's patched. <laughs> That's okay. We only wasted a little bit of souls. Only 200. Yeah, that's not too bad. <clears throat> but we are going to come up here and get the stuff. All right. <laughs> when you can't get into a door, remember, just attack. <laughs> yeah, just beat your way in. <laughs> Especially I don't want him to wake up and come back. You should beat your way in, especially if there's a girl behind it screaming for you to go away. <laughs> Just remember, keep doing it. Nice. Okay. Nice. Can yep. you do that in the Scholar of the First Sin? Nope. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, no, you definitely can. Yeah, you can, you can do it in Dark Souls 2. And, um, don't quote me, but Dark Souls 1. Okay. I have no idea this shit is here. Yeah, I have uh, some time in this. So. That's why, that's why I've been telling Andrew he should uh, be speed running this game. I used to, I used to. It was 13 minutes off pace, which isn't bad. Not bad. It's closer than I've ever been. I mean, I've never been. It took me like a little bit over an hour. You guys think he should be speed running from now on? Leave a comment in the description. If I get more than ten, if I get five comments, I will start speedrunning this game. So I'll make it happen. It doesn't count if you comment more than once. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and say that. One person oh, comments man. 50 times, like, hey, you got 50 comments. Uh, oh. Nice. Oh, he's right here, though. Oh, and he's kind of the first in. He was smooth a little bit, remember? Yeah, he was, actually. Alright, so we're actually gonna cut this episode here. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day and great gaming.